Hey everybody, how's it going? Miss PC Tricks back with you again. Today I'm going to show you how to change your IP with a software that will allow you to uh, either watch videos from um, websites that are outside your country and might block your country, or just to uh, disguise your IP if you want to browse privately. Uh, anyway, we're going to use a free software called Hotspot Shield. And there are two versions of the software. One is paid and one is free. The free one is ad supported, so you will see some ads as you're browsing, but no big deal. Um, we're going to go to hotspotshield.com, as you can see here, and you click download the latest version. And you can see there's this pop up window that says save file. And yes, you are going to want to save that file. And when you do save it, it'll download. I think it's like maybe 12 meg. I'm not sure. It doesn't take very long to download anyway. Then you're going to install it on your computer. And it doesn't take very long. All you have to do is click next and next and next and you're done. Um, but that's how easy it is to set up. We're going to go to the bottom of the screen here. And hopefully you can see this. Anyway, it's a little hotspot shield sign that will tell you if you are currently on browsing or not. Okay, here we go. There's this little hotspot shield sign. Right now I am disconnected, but we're going to change that. I'm going to right click, connect on. And it will take just a couple minutes to connect. Um, I've noticed that sometimes on weekends there's more traffic, on Friday nights there's more traffic, you know, when people are browsing and trying to watch videos and stuff on, like, Hulu. Um, a lot of countries don't allow Hulu, or Hulu, the other way around, Hulu doesn't allow a lot of countries. Um, Hotspot Shield generally works for getting around it, although I do not guarantee it. Uh, the way I know that is I did recommend it to a friend in the UK a couple months ago and he said it worked perfectly to get to Hulu and uh, he was really happy with it. Okay, so we're connected now and it's going to redirect us to Anchor Free, which is their homepage. You're going to, uh, you can just navigate anywhere from there. Now you'll notice this bar up top right here. And my mouse is freaking out. That's nice. Here we go. This bar right here. That's going to be on all of your website pages that you visit for the most part. Um, some, some websites will kind of block that so you might not get it on a forum or like Facebook or something like that. But anyway, you can go wherever you want to now. And you can see that there's an ad on top of Google now. And don't worry, that will go away when you disconnect the software. The other thing that you might like is uh, that you can usually get to Facebook using this program if either someone has blocked it from your firewall or from your IP address. Maybe it's a school, maybe it's a business. Um, <laughs> I should say as I'm recommending that you get around it, but if you need to, you know, there's that option for you too. But that's how easy it is to use. You can do any kind of browsing type in and you might notice that your internet's a little bit slower um, they are going to give the preference to paid users so you, you might not uh, surf quite as quickly download speeds might be a little bit slow also it might not stay connected for hours and hours and hours you might notice that the connection does drop out but hey it's free you know it usually lasts for several hours anyway and I get Hulu in my country so this probably isn't a, a real good example but um, but anyway, thought you might like to see that. Um, again, it works for if you want to privately browse, if you want to uh, watch something that is blocked in your country. It might, it might not work all the time, but it will work in many cases, and it's free. And when you want to disconnect uh, the browsing and get back to regular browsing, just go down below to this little green icon right click it, click disconnect off, and click disconnect. And you'll be back onto your regular uh, VPN. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Been a pleasure.